Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. And today in this video, I want to show you how to analyze thermal water port use solid board. And let's start it. If you want to know how to make this water pot, just click the link in the description that I have provided. And back to the topic. First step, activate solid work simulation and make the process. Three hours later. Click simulation. Click new study. Choose thermal analysis. Make name is thermal analysis. Okay. And next step, choose material part. Make handle material is plastic. Choose PA height density type. Click apply. Close. After that, make port material is stainless steel ferrous stick. With thermal conductivity 18 watt per meter Kelvin. After that, we define connection. Right click component contact, choose component contact. Click this and click handle make contact type isolate. It means heat doesn't not transfer for the handle. Okay. Next step, the thermal temperature. Right click thermal loads, choose temperature. Click this face. This face, this face, this face, and this face. My parameter temperature is 15 degrees Celsius. Okay. Right click thermal loads again and choose temperature. Click this face and this face. My parameter temperature is 100 degrees Celsius. Okay. High all thermal load parameter. And now we will do messing this analysis. Right click mess. Click create mess. Check mess parameter. Choose standard mess. OK. After done, click run the study. See, thermal analysis is ready. Right click thermal result, click edit definition. Make unit is Celsius. Check show minimum and maximum annotation. Choose this floating. Make this two. Okay. And now we can analyze this water pot. In maximum temperature, we see color is orange. It means the water pot with stainless steel material can heat water without damage due to the heat. I think it's the end of the tutorial. I hope you understand of this tutorial and can enjoy it. See you in the next video. Thanks for watching, bye bye.